Hey everybody, all right, now we're gonna cut the last one of, of soaping hot, which is my preferable method. It's so freaking easy, and I didn't have to buy ice, and I didn't have to wait for the lye to cool, and I didn't have to time the oil and the lye and keep everything the right temperature. It was just chunk, chunk, you know? Um, so that was pretty cool, but we have learned, you know, that Soaping hot means that you're going to have a thicker batter and you can't do some of the designs that you can do with soaping cool. So we're going to keep exploring soaping cool. <clears throat> of course, I'm using the Essential Depot Moles and supportive uh, stackable baskets. And I, do, I am loving the color that the annatto seeds are giving us with it once it's put in the oil and um, and diluted you might say or uh, simmered or whatever into it and I got a crack in this one a blasted expansion crack right there in the center can you see it and I took and heated it just a little bit with a blow dryer I took my finger and rubbed it and then I took my, and you got to be careful with these. You, if you put your fingertips in, you're going to go in. If you, or you're going to make fingerprints. Uh, you got to be really careful with these. <clears throat> but anyway, um, and so then I after it dried, I took a damp paper towel and lightly rubbed it. And it really looks better than it did when it started. But I'm really, really ticked about it because this one was so awesome. And I'm taking the back of my hand and I'm pushing these away from the cutter. <clears throat> they're very, very fragile at this point. Ooh, they're pretty. Oh, they're so pretty. I didn't know how I did this. I did so much yesterday. I can't remember. I'll have to look at the video. Isn't that gorgeous? Isn't that pretty? Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Yeah, baby. Look at that. All right. <laughs> that was so much fun. Except for I got a crack. I didn't want a crack. And so, you know, we're learning about this heat expansion thing. Oh, I got to set them out here for you to see. I forgot to do that with the last video. I had a customer that came in and our customers and I got sidetracked and I forgot to do that. Oh, these are so pretty. I just remembered. It was a Bennonite clay swirl. That's what it was. That's what did this beautiful soap. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, that is so awesome. And I like the fact that they don't look exact on every one. They have character and individuality. Oh, these are awesome. And what we did is, we, I remember now, we gave the hard oils to the lye first, and then we gave the liquid oils to the lye. And it got a little bit thicker than, um, than I thought it would but it still was very playful and movable and just easy to work with I remember now and we did a really pretty top except for I got an expansion crack all right so oh and the cinnamon orange is absolutely heavenly oh oh it is awesome Oh, oh, they smell awesome. Okay, so really good. Totally happy. I uh, hate that I got a crack. Talk about the expansion crack. Let me show you what the two bars look like that have them. That's the two that they really show up with, is those two there. So... But I don't think it's a big deal when it comes to selling the soap, for me. Uh, but 
Um, <clears throat> on that expansion crack, you know, y'all guys are helping me out so much that our experienced cold process soapers that are leaving comments to help us newbie soapers, newbie cold process soapers, and there's going to be a lot of cold process soapers that are new that are going to be coming in and watching these videos, and I hope that you will share your knowledge uh, as to why these expansion cracks occur, why we get ash, and how you prevent them because we've had some really great comments and learning from y'all has been awesome. So, thank you so much. I've been making soap and I know you've just watched my video. I don't know what it was. It might've been a caving video. It might've been a soaping video. It might have been a metal detecting video, or it might have just been some silly video I made at Lowe's. Who knows? But I have some links for you. Check them out. Please subscribe. Please leave a comment. Please hit the like button. 